it's something that really actually um, surprised me when the FDA decided to uh, approve a drug according to this uh, uh, surrogate marker because, of course, that's the target of, uh, of this drug, so that's interesting per se, but uh, still it's not very well related to cognition. We, we've seen that for a very long time with a big cohort. Amyloid load in the brain is not directly related to symptoms. So somehow it's difficult to make it a, a valid surrogate marker in clinical trials saying that we will uh, make uh, people better when we uh, only measure uh, a surrogate marker that is not related to cognition. So to me, it has never been a, a good um, surrogate endpoint for this uh, trial, and it will never be unless uh, we demonstrate properly that uh, uh, amyloid PET is a, is a valid uh, surrogate marker, which has not been done so far.